It's all a bit luck stuff, isn't it? This weekend, Top Dog won four awards, including uh, Best Picture and Best Actor at the British Independent Film Festival. How does that feel? It's great. Uh, yeah. I mean, any award, isn't it, is nice. It's, a, it's just a slap on the back and someone saying, yeah, we appreciate all the hard work you put in, really. But uh, listen, great performance, Best Actor. So, no, uh, it's, no it's, 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 quite, it's, it's quite simple. If you, did, if you spent two hours and not in front of the TV doing your homework, and you had to do it, not that you had to do it, what would you rather, a red cross or a green tick, you know? So it's yeah. nice to have a little pat on the back and say, you know, you're in the right direction and, you know, and all that stuff, yeah. And what are you excited for the audiences to see? We've picked a kind of, we, we've picked um, a murky world and we've said, look, you know, you all know that there's these kind of people out there, but let's have a look at, as I say, the knock-on effects of the home life from their actions. Yeah, because what it, what it is for me, you know, it's a, it's a performance film and uh, pre great performances from Leo and, and the rest of the cast that you don't usually get with one of these films. Usually you get great fight sequences and it's shot in different ways, but the performances always, for me, lack a little bit. And in this, it, it's fabulous to watch just as a piece of drama. Hello, Mickey. Long time no see. Billy Evans. This place. Shout now. Yeah, um, I love directing. It's kind of all my hobbies in one big ball, you know, in one big bag. It's it's a bit of uh, photography and there's drama and there's there's music that underpins it all. You know, it's everything that I've grown up doing in one big one big uh, bubble. So uh, I love doing it. But, you know, what was exciting about this film was uh, the collaboration that we had between uh, the writer, the producer, and, uh, and myself, and also the actors. So it was, you know, I've always grown up, because I, I suppose I'm an actor myself, and the loveliest thing that you can ever hear from a director is to say, have you got any ideas? What's your idea? Because uh, that give, fills you with confidence, you know, that, yeah, I'm being taken seriously. Uh, and that's kind of the way that I love to uh, work with, with any actor, you know, hear what they have to say. Because for me, the best idea should stick. That's the idea that goes on the screen. It doesn't matter where it comes from. It just, that's the idea that you, you're waiting to hear. How does the, wor the, the world of film compare to your, your time at Spandau Ballet? Uh, I absolutely think that we're all in the same bubble here, you know. Uh, you know, I started when I was seven, and I was, I was doing drama on TV when I was seven or eight. So uh, going into Spandau was just really, I was acting while I was in Spandau, playing a character. It wasn't me that you were seeing while I was in that band. It was me playing the part of me wanting to be Elvis Presley, you know, uh, and being a, drawn to that kind of charismatic rock star. You know, at one point I thought I was Jimmy Page, but I wasn't. But, but I was, so you're playing a part in that, you know. So uh, I've been playing a part all my life. So there's really no difference. And then when you get to directing, there's really no difference because it's all life experiences that you're, you're using. Uh, it's what I said earlier, you know, you're just lucky enough to be in, in this business, full stop. It's, it's a hard business to be in and to make something out of it is, is very lucky. You tell Billy Evans, I'll be seeing him. It's all a bit luck stuff, isn't it?